Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com and in this video I would like to give you not one, but three of my favourite free audio editing software packages. Let's get started with the package making it into position three, and the reason it's not higher is because it only works on one platform and that's a Mac. GarageBand is a fantastic free audio editor for Mac OS users. GarageBand is a fantastic free option for Mac users as it's so easy to get started. Whether you're making music or recording a podcast, you can just easily get going straight away and drag in any audio that you want to edit to different tracks. Uh, you can easily put on a compressor, you can record voiceovers, you can mix in a multi-track style view, and uh, it's even got bars and beats included as well for you if you want to do really cool stuff with your audio and start making music. A nice metronome feature, uh, plenty of different preset sounds and libraries that you can use, and a really intuitive Apple-style help uh, all the way throughout the app. In at number two, completely free and also cross-platform compatible Windows, Mac and Linux is LMMS. Fantastic if you want to dabble with music creation. LMMS is totally open source, it's cross-platform as I just mentioned, and it enables you to make music at the click of a button. You can just start creating your own beats and bass lines, you can choose from different plugins and different effects, and you can really go nuts here with different sample tracks. It's really like a light version of Logic Pro or Ableton or Fruity Loops, and it's completely free. Did I mention that already? A fantastic piece of audio editing software. And swiping the top spot, getting better and better all the time with a huge open source community around it, Number one is Audacity. And then there's the big one of them all. Yes, it is Audacity. Super user-friendly, a huge open source community, and the ability to play back audio and edit audio as you wish, turning volumes up and down, uh, making all kinds of edits to your audio as well, deleting things, and generally uh, it's good for editing waveforms and podcasts and other pieces of audio uh, that you want to edit. You can drag in multiple files as well, like so, and create a kind of mix of files in a multi-track style display. Plus, of course, you can select your audio input and output right here from the interface. One of the most intuitive uh, free audio editing software packages out there and available today. So there you go. Did I miss a free audio editor? One of the best free audio editing software packages on the market, maybe? Well, you let me know about it in the comments. I'd love to know your feedback. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more videos all about audio.